West All-Star team. They just got their win 6-0. And we'll start with the lone touchdown. You scored the only touchdown of the game. Can you kind of walk us through that play? Um, well, we uh, first called a stop route, and so my guy was about one yard off, and I decided I'll just turn this into a fade route, and luckily he bid on it, and so we got the touchdown right there. More importantly, can you walk us through the celebration? Um, we kind of figured that out beforehand. Me and McGinley thought, eh, might as well go out in style. So we, uh, we actually did that in practice. We had a roll the boat celebration, so we kind of made it better with the old Titanic at the front, but that's how we did it. And we were talking while we were walking over here. It's your last high school experience. How are you feeling right now? Um, I, happy and sad at the same time. I mean, uh, it's great I went on a win, but just really sad that it is my last game, but um, made some really great memories here. Well, that's Lucas Paluchek made a number of great plays going out with a bang. Now moving over here to the defensive player of the game, and this was a defensive battle all night long, and Lane McGinley here had an interception not far behind us in the end zone. Now can you walk us through that interception when it looked like you guys could maybe be tied up or even go down? Uh, well, they were on like the two-yard line or maybe three-yard line, and then they got a uh, penalty, so they backed it up to like the seven, and then they had a run right up the middle that got like three yards or something, and then... He backed up for a pass, and I knew it was going to be a pass because they ran like four run plays in a row, so I knew it was going to be a pass. And then I backed up, and I started going to my left, and then there was no one over there. I don't know why I was going over there. And then I saw like three people over to the right, so I just ran over there, and he threw it right to me. So. And you took it out, and if it would have been open, you think you would have had the energy to go all the way back to the other end zone? Uh, yeah, probably adrenaline and stuff. Love that, love that. And then this isn't your last football game. You're playing at the next level. Can you kind of tell us about those plans? Um, playing at Black Hill State next year. I think I'm redshirting there, so outside linebacker. And there were a few other Black Hill State guys that played tonight. Can you kind of talk about being able to be on the same field as them now and then how that will help you come camp time? Well, Devin Austin, I played with him my entire life. He's been on my team since flag football, or I played against him at least in flag football. And then, so I, I'm used to playing against him. He's great. He's a really good player. And uh, Trent Reed, he's a really great guy. I got to know him pretty well over the past couple days, and he's really funny great guy to work with and he's a freaking bowl when he has the ball it's awesome awesome well congratulations to both of you guys we'll let you go celebrate with your teammates over there